Church. You are witnessing what doctors, family, and teachers never knew would happen. Eight-year-old Lucas taking steps by himself for the first time. There wasn't a dry eye, there wasn't a staff, there wasn't a student that didn't run out in the halls to see because of course they heard all the screaming and the, so we are beyond proud of him. Lucas was born prematurely and at nine months old, he was diagnosed with the most severe type of cerebral palsy. He has been in therapy since he was just five months old, battling challenges for years. And this is the result. Look at the motivation. For Lucas, it does take a lot of hard work to do typical things in life that we take for granted. And I think by stopping and looking at that, people are able to see that if you work hard enough, you can achieve. And that's a lesson that Lucas inspires his fellow students to achieve each and every day. I never saw Lucas walking or running, so I was just so happy and excited that he did that. I'm proud of him. He teaches us like he's really happy all the time. Friends. Does it show you that if you keep trying, you can do anything? Yeah. His educators say this also shows the importance of funding and therapy in schools for special needs kids. Without the funding and giving him the support, he wouldn't have made, made these gains. And even though Lucas is nonverbal, friends and family say his smile speaks a thousand words about how proud he is of his own determination. And he was just so happy to read all of the positive feedback that he was receiving through his social media page. And Lucas doesn't plan to stop there. He next hopes to master his walking and work further on his communication. In Brampton, Audra Brown, City News.